Company Facilities Directory, May Neutral Order. It's February 26, 2018. Now, I'm just going to announce ahead of time the, uh, the Joint Facilities Districts, and that's one, Community Facilities, General District Number One, Palm Valley Community Facilities District Number Three, Three Community Facility Utility Districts Number One, Four Wildflower Ranch Community Facilities District, Five Wildflower Ranch Community Facilities District Number Two, Six Cottonflower Community Facility District, and Seven Australia Mountain Ranch Community Facilities District, Eight Kings Ranch Community Facilities District, Nine Centera Community Facility District, and Ten and the last Cortina Community Facilities District. Everyone is here tonight except Councilman Stitt. So could I have a motion to uh, excuse him? So moved. All right, I heard a motion from board member Osborne. I hear a second from what board member? Board member Hampton. So all in favor say aye. 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 Ayes have it, he is excused. We don't have any communication items. Now is the time for a citizen who would like to address the uh, CFD board on a, any non-agenda item, of course, within the jurisdiction of the board. Is there anybody here? All right, then we'll proceed. Are there any speaker cards? No, Mayor. All right. So we'll go to consent agenda. Will the city clerk please read consent agenda item 5.1 by title only, please? 5.1, approved draft minutes of the community facilities district special joint meeting held on January 8th, 2018. Thank you. Does anyone wish to remove an item from the consent agenda? On the board, is there anyone who would like to remove an item? All right. That's great. We're on with it. Can I have a motion and a second? So moved. All right. I heard uh, from board member Loritano, a um, motion and a second from Vice Chair Campbell. So roll call vote, please. Vice Chairman Campbell? Aye. Board member Osborne? Aye. Board member Pozzillo? Aye. Board member Loritano? Aye. Board Member Hampton? Aye. Chairman Lord? Aye. The motion carries six out. Great. Let's go to business. 7.1 is to consider approving the resolution CFUD 2018-104, authorizing the defense, did I get it right, <laughs> of a portion of the CFUD number one GO refunding bond series 2014. Doug Sandstrom, our district treasurer, will be presenting. Douglas? Chairman, members of the board, I'm here this evening to uh, discuss the defeasance of $2.8 million um, utilizing a special reserve fund established during the Suncor bankruptcy. Um, this is for uh, community facility U district number, district number one. Uh, the defeasance, what it does is it takes funds that we currently have on hand that are currently restricted from the bankruptcy of Suncor for the payment of debt and puts them into an irrevocable trust, thereby just adding an extra level of protection for the district. That irrevocable trust will then make debt service payments on the city's behalf for that portion of bonds that have been defeased, thereby lowering our debt service for the next few years, and thereby also lowering the required tax rate for it. So the tax rate in the CFUD has been running about $1.15 per $100 of assessed valuation. By taking this money and putting it into that trust, it will lower that anticipated tax rate by 15 cents down to the targeted $1 for this district. And with that, I will open it up for any questions. Thank you. Are there any speaker cards? No, Chairman. Would anybody in the audience like to speak? All right, will the district clerk please read resolution number? Community Facilities Utilities District number one, resolution number 2018-104. Thank you. Could I have a motion? Second. Our Vice Chair Board Member Campbell and a second from Board Member Pazillo. Open for council discussion. Yes, board member Osborne. Thank you. Okay, so I did have to go look this up because I had never heard of this before. Um, very creative, that was, that was outstanding. And I'm uh, assuming that it's the, I know that we originally had a million dollars, I believe, from that whole process with um, Sun, Suncor. Suncor way back when. Um, so creative, this was outstanding way of, of doing this that I can tell. I'm surprised. We didn't think of it earlier, uh, not me, but <laughs> but that's, you know, very good. I, I appreciate that you brought this in front of us. Thank you. Any other comments? All right. So with this, could I have a roll call vote, please? Board Member Osborne? Aye. Board Member Pozzillo? Aye. Board Member Loritano? Aye. Board Member Hampton? Aye. Vice Chairman Campbell? Aye. Chairman Lord? 
Aye. The motion carries. Great. So we're on the information items. Do you have any comments from the board? None. All right. District manager? None. All right. No staff summary? Any inquiries? Don't have any of that. So the next meeting will be a work session, and we're going to follow it as soon as I dismiss this meeting. So this is adjourned. And we're going to call a work session to order on February 26, 2018. It's 4.35. Um, sorry, I didn't give you time to get out the